When most people go travelling overseas, they usually rely on trains, planes and automobiles. But a former Darwin resident is using her own two feet, hoping to become the first woman to walk the length of the world. For the past year, Lucy Barnard has been trekking over freezing mountain ranges, through deserted backcountry and along empty stretches of coastline, hoping to walk her way into the record books. I go through ups and downs, but I cannot believe that I got through winter and that I got through my first month. The 35-year-old Australian is one of a handful of people each year who set off to walk the length of the world. What I found was that of all the people who attempt it, about 10 men have succeeded but no women. So I was like, come on, one of us has to give it a go. It's a 30,000 kilometre mission from the southern tip of Argentina to the northern edge of Alaska. Lucy Barnard's already covered 3,000 kilometres and she's under no illusion about how long the whole trip could take. That's going to be in like three, four, five years. <laughs> Her backpack weighs almost 30 kilograms and with wild weather to endure and days on end without human contact, it can be a lonely and challenging experience. The hardest week that I've had is a week where everything broke and then I drank some water that was contaminated with I don't know what and I was publicly sick. It was a disaster. But for every low, there's a high, including the generosity of locals keen to offer their support. <laughs> chocolate! Chocolate! They'll give me chocolate or they'll ask if I need water or they'll ask me if I need somewhere to stay in the next town. It's incredible. An incredible adventure she's taking one step at a time. Jano Gibson, ABC News.